Hello traders. Let's have a quick daily review forecast for S&P USA 500 as we discussed in our weekly forecast video yesterday. The price moved on to the daily fair value gap uh, and uh, from last week after getting this weekly liquidity pool price came down and uh, what we can see for this week we are targeting this weekly fair value gap to be retested at least we want to see the price going into this weekly gap uh, not necessarily by this week but we expect that to happen by this this week as a good chance after coming down to this weekly fair value gap as indicated by horizontal orange line then we will see if the price wants to go up on a daily chart or we are going back to this weekly low in a long term uh, analysis time frame forecast so here if i go back to the daily jar daily chart just to show you that this is what we were expected yesterday and it's exactly happened so the price came down to this daily fair value gap which is the low of this candle and high of this candle and right now that uh, i'm recording this video price is uh, it came to this daily order block this candle this bearish candle it's a bullish order block on a daily time frame and it's trying to retest this area we are expecting price to go up from here and based on what we are going to get tomorrow on tuesday then we can see what is going to happen for the rest of the week so but our first scenario which is the most probable one we want to see some kind of uh, corrective price action to the upside from here as we are in the daily order block so we should expect the price to push up from here and after that after uh, kind of weekly price action uh, manipulation then we are going to hit our uh, going to hit our target profits for the week on the 4082 which is the beginning of this fair value gap and it can go further down to fill this 50 percent of this imbalance on the weekly or even 90 percent or 100 percent of this weekly uh, imbalance so this is our forecast but we have to see our pr the price action by tuesday so then we can exactly forecast what is going to be expected for the rest of the week um, so second scenario which we are giving less chance because you know trading is a game of probability and when uh, we are doing our analysis based on our unique strategy which is relying on the price action and uh, concepts like liquidity imbalance uh, high and low and uh, market structure shift so this kind of concept which uh, you will learn a lot about this concept 
by time uh, when we get more subscribers and we see the interests of our uh, subscribers by time definitely it we will be motivated to have more uh, kind of uh, conceptual training for you to learn exactly about uh, how we are looking to the price action and how we are getting our perfect entries and uh, target profit and the supplies. So this uh, uh, this kind of things here, uh, as I said, uh, we have to see what is going to happen on Monday, Tuesday. And then we can see what uh, can what will be expected actually for the rest of the week. So our second scenario, which as I said is going to have less chance, um, we have to either get some kind of accumulation, consolidation here, and then we may get another manipulation to the downside. But of course, not reaching this big different value gap. A uh, little and uh, more uh, manipulation to the downside. And then we expect the price to push up and uh, uh, reaching maybe uh, 4, 2, 5, 7 to fill this daily gap. Or even going above this high, which is. Uh, Mm, to be honest, is having a less chance uh, at the moment. Uh, our more our high probability uh, opportunity for this week to the is going to be to the downside. So I want you to watch our uh, video tomorrow as well, which uh, I'm going to confirm uh, what is going to happen for the next uh, for the rest of the week. But consider uh, that our first uh, high probable scenario is going to be to the downside. So tomorrow on Tuesday, look for your sell setup entry. Let's quickly have a look to the one hour chart as well. And here in the H1, you can see uh, we have the opening gap. We had this uh, gap uh, during the Asian session. So then price it moved up i'm going to little zoom in so you can see here exactly we have this opening gap on the one hour chart and the price pushed up to uh, retest this gap any gap in our strategy uh, we expect to be important area to be uh, focused for our uh, actions okay so from here if we move to the lower, lower time frame, definitely we can see uh, how we can uh, find the perfect entry even from here, or uh, we can get a, uh, another entry during the uh, London session opening. If we go to the 15 minute chart, we can see that after this gap, you can see here, it gave us another, uh, there is no uh, 15 minute gap here. So if I go to even uh, lower time frame, like five minutes. So here you can see that we got, uh, this was the, yeah. Here, this was the London session, as you can see. We got this kind of manipulation above, and it came to this uh, uh, this uh, actually fair value gap. You can see it gave the weak inside, but it never closed inside. So this was the London session manipulation, and the price uh, moved to the downside uh, to reach to the 50% of this daily imbalance and finally uh, 
in this was the New York manipulation. You can see exactly what's happening. Accumulation and then New York is giving manipulation above this high and then price is giving distribution after New York session open and now we are uh, having another kind of accumulation consolidation during the uh, new US launch time so this is uh, the story of today and this was the story of today and you can see the story line that every day we are having this kind of price actions for all the markets we are analyzing one market now last week we were analyzing crude oil and uh, maybe next week we will choose another market but uh, consider uh, first of all we uh, we want the high volatility market to find more setups uh, and, but uh, the fact is that all the markets are having the same kind of uh, logic in the price action every single day and every single uh, market session, e e Asian session, London session, or New York session, no difference. You can see the same logic is happening in all the time, uh, in all the sessions, in all the time frames, and in all the every single day in the market. And uh, that logic for us is uh, the concept of uh, accumulation manipulation and distribution uh, which uh, we will definitely uh, going to have uh, uh, many courses for this kind of things and we are going to teach a lot of stuff uh, in this channel quality effects trading for all of you who are interested to learn about trading and uh, improve their uh, trading skills so if uh, you are watching this video and you have this mentality and you have these goals and you are this much motivated to learn so I'm telling you you are in the right place uh, and just hit the subscribe button so and also enable the notification so you will be notified for every video and uh, I promise that by time you will see a lot of uh, content and materials in our channel which uh, I hope is going to be useful. Uh, it just takes time for now we are doing daily analysis and like weekly charts and time to time we may post some kind of uh, concepts uh, just to teach to teach you some kind of concept in a short videos uh, but by time uh, we will definitely have more stuff and more content which is going to be interesting and uh, helpful for your uh, trading every day so if uh, you are interested please subscribe to the channel and uh, even share these videos to all you know they are interested so they can get benefit uh, stay tuned and uh, we have much more for you to come uh, thank you for the attention and thanks for watching us and following our videos every day so talk to you by tomorrow